what's very important in our study of the environment, and particularly in universities that are doing fundamental research in subjects like ecology, are what we call ecosystem services. And these are manifest. It doesn't take a lot of imagination or common sense to know what they are. They include, for example, the free purification of water. Uh, let a natural forest and the watershed do it. Why strip all the forest off and build a multi-million dollar filtration plant uh, that's always breaking down when you, all you have to do is let the forest sit there? Uh, the uh, ecosystem services uh, include uh, the uh, manufacture of a great deal of the food we eat. Uh, still, most of our seafood, just to take one of many examples, and so on. Uh, through uh, and up to uh, creation of the very atmosphere we breathe, which we can screw up badly if we take too many of the atmosphere-creating organisms away. Uh, now, it's been estimated that the ecosystem services that are given to us scot-free as long as we leave these natural ecosystems alone, just let them go so that they can continue the way they have been for millions and even billions of years. Those ecosystem services, if you can put a dollar on it, have been estimated to be approximately equal to the total global world economy production. Uh, you know, everything we produce in the way of uh, national uh, domestic uh, product uh, all combined is equal roughly by the natural services of the, of the uh, living world. And all we have to do to reap it is leave it alone. <laughs>